Today I'm going to show you how to create this interesting photo manipulation. Alright, so let's get started. Hi, this is Marlon Balbastro. Welcome to another really fun episode. Today we will create this really cool and interesting photo manipulation out of several different stock images. Stay with me till the end of this episode and enjoy your ride. And before we start, I just want to say that this video is sponsored by SoundRaw.io. SoundRaw is an artificial intelligence music generator. It's an amazing tool to generate unique music for your videos like Facebook, Instagram, YouTube videos, or video games content. Whatever you want and the music is fully licensed. You just need to go to SoundRaw.io. You need to choose different moods, genre, length, tempo, and instruments and this is how it goes. Let's choose chill. Let's choose cinematic and let's choose 5 or 3 minutes of the music and we can select the tempo. We can select the instruments or deselect certain instruments that we don't want to be included. But I will leave everything on and click create music. Now the AI part of the software will generate 15 different songs and everything. Every time you click create music it will randomize 15 different songs that are unique. So let's listen to them. So, for example, I like this one and I can just download it here or put it a favorite, or I can edit the music so I can press edit. And here is where this fun part starts. We can do a lot of things right there. Customize it in our own needs so we can expand it or shorten it down. We can change the BPM or bits per minute. We can change different instruments, different key and also the volume of separate tracks. And we can do a lot of here. So let's listen to this. So we can add more backing or remove backing, or just leave with baking one. Then here we can add bass and fill have something like this. Fill here and that's it. And we can even go stop it and then expand it if we want longer. Maybe we want even longer minute. And we can customize every single part here which is really amazing. We can nail it to our needs. Also, we can go and add our video here so we can preview it right there. You can do everything online like I did here and just download the music and use it there. You can choose annual plan for $16.6 .6 per month. You can generate unlimited songs, bookmark songs, download up to 50 songs per day, YouTube and social media, corporate videos, web ads, TV and radio commercials, broadcast programs and movies, games and apps etc. Also, if you just want to pay it for one month, it's almost $20 or 19.9 US dollars. Now let's have a look at the final result with the music created using SoundDraw. As you already saw, this is really amazing AI music generator and the benefit of using this one is that you can create your own music. You can generate your own music and tweak it to match your own needs and you will have unique piece of music for your video content. Read guys if you want to try it. Check out the link down the description and then if you like you can always go to monthly or annual plan right now. Alright. Let's jump straight into Photoshop and let the fun begin. Okay we will start with blank piece of paper and if you're wondering what's the document size here it's 3200 by 4000 pixels 150 dpi resolution. We will use as you can see several different stock images to create our projects. So first what I like to do I like to go with the ground. Now I will use a pen tool to mask the part of the ground that is not needed. Next we place the helmet on the ground. Next is the mountain. And next we put the sky. Now let's erase this sky because we don't need it anymore. 
Next let's put the moon and change the blending mode to screen. Now we can select the ground and press Ctrl Command G to put it in a group and rename it to ground. Let's use exposure and just make everything darker and then just paint on the mask right here. Select the helmet layer and press Ctrl Command G to put it in a group and renamed it helmet. Use exposure and just make everything darker and then just paint on the mask right here. Select the mountain layer and press Ctrl Command G to put it in a group. Use exposure and just make everything darker. Select sky and press Ctrl Command G to put it in a group. Use exposure and darken it a little. Also you can add saturation adjustment layer to ground. Clip it to effect only and set to colorize and go with a bluish tint something like this. Do it the same with the other layers. Now let's put the bonfire on and adjust the opacity to around 50% and let's mask it and paint in the area that we need. Now let's add another saturation layer. Again clip it to effect and colorize to this warm color. Let's repaint the side of the helmet for highlights. Let's add another saturation layer again. Again clip it to effect and set to colorize and go with a bluish color. Let's just paint on the mask again for the helmet highlight. Now let's add an orange color fill to the ground and let's set the blending mode to linear dodge. Let's paint this area. Now let's put some mist and put a comet in the sky. Now let's go to the camera raw filter and just make a final color correction. That's cool. Here is the final result. Thanks for watching.